One of the last frontiers is an expression that couldn't be closer to the truth where Papua New Guinea is concerned. Whether nature or culture excites you, this is one of the most diverse and untouched lands on earth. And in reality, is not at all difficult to visit. With so much to see, it's hard to believe Papua New Guinea is one of the least visited countries on earth. The last frontier awaits. Papua New Guinea is in the South Pacific and lies directly north of Australia. To the northeast of mainland Papua New Guinea lies the mysterious and beautiful New Island province. New Island is the long narrow island north of New Britain and the province also includes a number of islands off the northwest end, the largest being New Hanover. To the east lie a further string of islands including Lihir, one of the world's largest gold mines. The people of New Island are Melanesian and speak 22 local languages. Traditional clan power is wielded by chiefs, but the clan rights and land claims are passed on in a matrilineal system. New Island has perfect white sand beaches and rivers of clear water tumbling down from the ruggedly forested central Slanitz range. In the remote south is the spiritual home of Tumbuan culture. In the north are the intriguing traditions of Malangan, while Kabai culture dominates in the central areas. New Island is a beautiful, friendly and easygoing place, and although little known and rarely visited, is easily accessible to those looking for that special once-in-a-lifetime adventure. Caving in New Island is serviced daily from Port Mosby by jet aircraft flying in New Guinea. Caving is a sleepy little town with an attractive harbour and a range of restaurants, bars and facilities including banks, supply stores and supermarkets. Places to stay include hotel, guest house and resort style accommodation, while easygoing traditional style bungalows are situated among the islands offshore. From Kaviang, you can choose to head down the main coastal road of New Island or head out into the many beautiful islands offshore. New Island, known as the mainland by the locals, is mountainous and riddled with huge flooded caves. Much of the east coast can be reached by the Bulminski Highway, which runs most of its length. This coast consists of one breathtaking beach after another, traditional villages and lagoons of surpassing beauty. Friendly guest house and bungalow-style accommodation is available at various points, providing an opportunity to experience traditional community life at a true grassroots level. You might even be lucky enough to join a traditional ceremonial feast. The remote west coast is also accessible by road, with rugged rainforest clad mountains falling steeply into the sea. The ancient art of shark calling is practiced here. Midway down the island, the Lelet Plateau rises to over 1,200 meters and is very different from the steamy coast. The vegetation consists of many fans and beautiful orchids. And the climate is cool enough to grow vegetables, which cannot be grown on the coast. Mountaintop guest house accommodation is available and is the perfect location from which to experience traditional highland plateau life. The northwestern islands with the friendly people, wide sandy beaches, crystal clear waters, 
pristine coral reef systems and rolling surf are an unspoiled paradise. An incredible opportunity for discovery and adventure, or just simple relaxation. Many of the Palm Fringe Islands contain picturesque villages, and the largest island called New Hanover has spectacular river systems, waterfalls and mountains. Here, sago is prepared, which is a staple food source for many of the islanders. These remote and beautiful island groups can be explored by boat and really are a journey back to an ancient time. Comfortable guest house accommodations are available in some of the most idyllic locations imaginable. Or perhaps the adventure, freedom and simplicity of a liveaboard yacht charter might appeal to you. Either way, visitors will experience a fascinating culture largely unchanged for thousands of years. The vast diversity to be found in the New Island province provides abundant opportunity for travelers to this exciting new region. Soon after World War II spread to the Pacific, New Island fell and Kavian was developed into a major Japanese base. Many relics from this violent past still exist today. Massive bomb craters, gun emplacements and bunkers can be visited. Explore alone or with guided walks. The maze of spectacular reefs and World War II wrecks offer some of the most diverse and exciting diving on Earth. Dive operators offer courses, equipment and tours to a great variety of pristine, uncrowded locations. Diving is possible all year round. And the reefs are not only for divers, excellent visibility and abundance of fish make them perfect for snorkelers as well. Consistent northwest swells from early November through to April provide world-class uncrowded waves with a great variety of perfect reef breaks. Accommodation is available to surfers with surf transfers provided to the best breaks on the day. The myriad of islands can be explored by a traditional dugout canoe or a guided sea kayak tour can be booked providing the ultimate freedom to experience up close some of the rich sea and island life. Bike tours are also available and are another great way to take in the tropical scenery and experience village life. Tours are conducted on the east coast of New Island. The clear waters around the many islands are some of the richest fishing grounds on earth, providing a real opportunity for those keen to catch perhaps that fish of a lifetime. Tours and chatters can be organized out of KVN. And perhaps the ultimate in freedom and access to this remote cultural wonderland is on a liveaboard chatter. Experience the untold marvels of this region in style and comfort as you cruise from island to island, diving, snorkeling, surfing, fishing, and experiencing the rich local culture. The new island province of Papua New Guinea is one of the world's most timeless, diverse and exciting discoveries of modern times. It's safe, it's easily accessible and it's waiting for you.